So here's what we're polar bear is going to look like when it arrives, and I'm going to show you how to put it together and grease it up and get it ready to be used. So, you know, just takes the plastic off and uh, we'll unwrap, unwrap the shrink wrap. If you got trouble, you can use a knife or whatever, or you just you can just easily unwrap it. There's no point in getting a knife. And uh, there, there you go. It's, uh, and that's about it. It's just, uh, it's already assembled, ready to go. No grease needed. No, um, no nuts or bolts. It's ready to go, right out of the wrapper. So, um, yeah, that's about it. Um, I guess I could, uh, I guess I could, I don't know, put some rubber gloves on for some reason. I guess, I don't know. But it's, you know, it's pretty much ready to go. Right out of the wrapper. There's no nuts or bolts. It's all, it's all, um, it's all in one piece. Yeah, so, anyway. I don't know, I guess I'll, I'll just put some, just uh, put some rubber gloves on here, I guess, and, uh, I don't know, some rubber gloves, and, I don't know why, I just, they feel good, I guess, yeah, there we go, there we go, I got now, I got all the gloves are on now, and uh, we're ready to go, so, uh, you know, um, you can rub it here, and, Move it around and look at it, and kill some time while you're waiting for the uprooter to put his together. Hmm. Yeah, no grease on this thing. You never put grease on this thing. Just attracts the dirt, makes a hell of a mess. So uh, no grease. Absolutely no grease. Gets dirty, you can wash it, hang it to dry or something. You can hang it to dry because uh, we're the only uh, tree puller that actually puts a lanyard on the end for you so you can hang it in your shop to dry or just to get out of the way. And uh, I guess that's it. We're just going to wait for uh, Curtis here to finish uh, putting his uprooter together and then we'll go out and we're going to pull some weeds. No grease, so nice how clean it is. No crap, no grease all over it. Nothing over here. Alrighty. So, uh, yeah, so, so no grease required. Yeah, it's all smooth, no grease. All dry joints because uh, you put grease on it, you're just going to attract the sand and the dirt, and it's going to make a hell of a mess. So, yeah, I'm going to take a glove off now, too. Yeah, put a tool on the top, and you know, there's no pins or anything, so it's already together, so you don't have to do anything. Um, I don't know. And, well, I don't have a cotter pin to sweat, to, to put in. And I don't have another piece to grease up. So, I, I don't know. What should I do? Hurry up, Curtis, will you? Let's get going. Got work to do. Oh, boy. Ugh. Jeez, stuff with the grease, man. Look at this. You want a clean tool. You don't want something that's going to collect dirt. Moisture. Cotter pin? I have no cotter pins. There's no cotter pins. What? There's no cotter pins here. There's zero. So welded. Nothing. There's no need to bend it. You don't even need one. Like, I don't get it. Grease and cotter pins and pins. I mean, what's the point? Look at 
Curtis, that's a mess.